Hello. All right, two out of four pistol parts. We're getting there. Now, they said that there were three of these strong boxes in this region. I wonder if the other two are just going to be the pistol parts, because that'd be awesome to complete that while I'm here. Not that I don't enjoy using the bow. I really, really do. But it would also be nice to uh, have an actual firearm ability, just in case the shit ever really hits the fan. Oh, boy. <laughs> It's kind of amazing how many things tend to do that in this world. <laughs> the whole breaking apart, <laughs> falling down thing. Everything you jump on, it's like at some point, is going to fall apart on you. Alright. Whoa, whoa, chill, Lara. Chill. I just want to see where I'm going. Oh, I can't aim when I'm balanced like this. Damn it. Okay, let's take a quick look around. Alright, let's do it. Alright, where the hell am I now? Does this actually, like, start a fire if I chuck it, or... Oh, it really does. Oh, shit! I didn't even try that. tracking them for weeks, watching as hundreds of men build the iron monstrosity across the ice. Men have died, their frozen bodies left scattered in the tundra. No rites of passing, no burial or burnings. These new invaders are cruel, godless men. Do they come seeking the precious metals of the mountain? Or like so many before them, are they drawn here by the divine source? My people must again prepare for war the divine source huh hey uh, this is a really poor place to put this if you're trying to build tension with the whole dialogue going on on the other side of that window Alright, I guess I'm just supposed to take these guys out. We don't have time for this. I have to report back to command. That was easy. Okay, I've got 18 rounds for this gun. Nice. Give me a second, buddy. I gotta loot. So much for that guy. I probably could have helped him out a little faster, but I don't think it actually would have mattered. <laughs> That's cool, so I do have a pistol now. Can I loot this guy? I have no respect for the dead. Alright, we can pry that open. Or we can look at this. Missing gear. Opening this object requires the lockpick. Bullshit, here's my lockpick right here. That's crap. That would totally work in a real-life scenario. Alright, guess we're coming back here when we get a lockpick, guys.
By the way, I still don't know... Okay, up on the D-pad, down on the D-pad. That's my quick select for my weapons. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, game. <laughs> now they tell me. Alright, we'll keep this equipped in case we get surprised. But we're still going to try to be stealthy. And they just filled up my ammo, so obviously there's going to be some shit going on. I left you in charge here. Yes, sir. But we didn't expect such heavy resistance. You were to be my eyes. I expected you to see. You must know what is at stake with this operation. Yes, but no. 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 You don't. No. How could someone like you? Go easy. Go easy. Don't fear the suffering. That guy's intense. Our goal is within reach, but we must be vigilant. If we succeed here, a new world awaits. One of our own making. Constantine, you need it back at the prison right away. We've got a captive who might know something about the artifact. Remain faithful. We will share in the glory of the divine source. Oh God. Please. What do we do with him? No. Nobody touch him. Looks like Fuck. we got another fuel leak. What the hell happened? This thing is 50 years old. Yeah, it looks like the valve failed. All right, let's get it shut. We can't afford to lose any more after that attack. Okay, I got this. Did you guys notice that guy? Kind of looks like Jonah. <laughs> Damn it. Cuffing is stripped. You want to give me a hand? Yeah, sure. It's like he puts on a little makeup to make his skin a little darker and just goes undercover, <laughs> infiltrating these guys. Okay. Okay, let's get serious. They said something about a fuel leak. That makes me think I can find, like, a lantern and throw it at them and cause a giant fire and kill everybody. And I want to do that if that's an option. That sounds amazing. This guy's got to go, though. That was the guy who looked like Jonah. Take it easy. God damn thing is rusted through. How's it looking? Nah, I'm not sure I can stop the leak. If this doesn't work, we'll have to crimp the pipe until we get a new valve. Not sure we'll be able to find spare parts out here. Okay. Okay. Gimme give gimme give this thing. Let me have it. Why can't I pick this up? God damn it. I think I screwed myself by bringing this bottle. <laughs> I think I heard something. I'll take a look. Here we go. Here we go. Stay alert. Heads up, incoming! Yes! Oh shit! Oh, yes! Oh my god! Oh shit! Ugh. Get down, take cover! Where the hell is he shooting me from? Oh, he's up top. How is he standing there? That's bullshit. All 
Alright, hopefully he was the last one. <laughs> I did end up getting almost everybody with that. Oh shit. Oh, there's people out there. Alright. Let's see, they said right bumper to heal, right? Yeah. That took a feather? Really? Alright, well that definitely succeeded in getting the way open. <laughs> Taking out almost everybody. Oh, I should have shot this barrel. Damn it. Hello, what are you? More Soviet propaganda. Night won't prevent us from working. Cool. Russian skill went up. Alright, let me uh, make sure I didn't miss anything in here. I kind of wish you could choose to leave this on while you're moving, actually. Alright, I think we're good. Yeah, so that was a little janky the way- so I brought that bottle over, and because of that, it wouldn't let me pick up the lantern. So I had to throw the bottle and get rid of it, and then I still had to like reposition myself just to get the lantern. But it all worked out in the end. But the downside of that is that now these guys all know I'm here. Although I think I did kill everybody. <laughs> that was, like, in the vicinity. Who knows if they actually alerted anybody. The rest of the base might just think that, you know, the thing blew up and not really know why. Constantine is here. The man who tried to kill me in Syria. He's violent. Dangerous. But worse, he appears entirely devoted to his misguided beliefs. I seem to have a habit of running afoul of religious zealots. I suppose it all goes with the territory. His men on the radio mentioned a prisoner with information. Could it be one of the natives I've encountered? And if so, what does he know? Trinity will not be kind in their methods. Perhaps I can find him. Find out what he knows. Earning the trust of the locals might prove useful. Damn, guys, these upgrades go deep. Can't do anything to the revolver yet. Not sure if I will, even when I can. I like to wait a little while and see, like, what becomes available. And see what gun I think I'm going to be using for, you know, the long haul. But these upgrades sure are coming at a fast rate. And these skills. So that's really cool. Let's see, bonus XP. I already have that one. <laughs> uh, light foot. Cineary bombs. Resourceful combatant. Enemies killed or knocked out from crafted handheld objects. I still don't know exactly what that constitutes. Like, is, is a bow a crafted handheld object? It technically is. But I don't know if that's what the game means in that type of category, you know? Um, thick skinned is like the first upgrade in this whole tree. This is probably a good thing to get early on. Less damage from gunfire and melee attacks. Yeah. We will grab that. Alright. So we've gotten one mural, three survival caches. Is There's got to be a button to bring that back up. There has to be. What if I move away and come back? I uh, guess not. If anybody knows a way to do that, please let me know in the comments, because that's... It's such a small thing, but that's going to piss me off. <laughs> I guess if that's the biggest thing you have to complain about, then that's a good thing. But yeah. It's such a useful menu. Like, I, I want to use it. I still think I should be able to just run up to these rabbits and stab them with my axe. 
They're the shittiest rabbits in the world. Look how slow this guy is. You fat fuck. You've been eating way too many carrots. Gotta slim back. Oh, picked off. Alright. What the hell am I doing? Um, looting this and then climbing up the ladder. Without being seen, there must be another way. You know, to be honest with you guys, I'm not even sure why I am trying to like go after these guys right now. I guess I'm just trying to get through this place to get to the ruins because I guess they're on the other side. But I don't really know. Hmm, okay. Um What the fuck? Don't shoot. I'm not your enemy. Uh who are you? That was really unexpected. <laughs> who are you people? All that can come later. If you want answers, then listen close. We've managed to destroy the old radio tower, but there are repeaters that keep them connected. We need to shut them down. Help me, and I'll let the others know they can trust you. We need all the allies we can get. Sure. Oh, the lockpick is the reward. I like that they tell you that up front. I'll keep an eye out for them. Good. We don't have much time. Optional mission indicator. Survival instinct can highlight locations and objects critical to completing missions. All right. Tell me this is a whoa. Good God. So, do the repeaters count as the incense burners of this region? <laughs> I don't know. There's so many systems at play in this game, it's ridiculous. Seriously? Lock tease. This game is filled with lock teases. That's not a serious complaint, though. That's, that's awesome when games give you something to strive for, and you know what you're striving for, you know? I've infiltrated the ranks of the enemy and learned that they come seeking the rich resources of the mountain. They appear to know nothing of the secret we protect. Those who build the Iron Road are themselves prisoners, slaves of the Red Army. Massive machines now use the Iron Road, bringing more slaves, food, and raw materials for construction of a small city. It is time for me to return to my people so we might plan our attack. If we can inflict heavy losses upon them before they reach the mountain, they may give up and turn back. Mm. I do like the stories that these little snippets give you, but it's kind of hard to piece them all together. Ooh, lots of ammo. Can I talk to this bro? Have you done it? Are the transmitters destroyed? I Dude, you, haven't found them all yet, but I will. You just asked me, like, literally a minute ago. I don't need another impatient man in my life, alright? That's why I go out and raid tombs, because I ain't got time for that shit. Okay. Guys, we've made it to a new area. This looks big and imposing and lots of cool stuff to do. I can't wait to jump into this and... Unlock even more stuff. I'm really enjoying this game so far. And as a big fan of the old Tomb Raider games, um, I'm really glad that it's it's the series is finally getting like the care and attention that it deserves. It's been a long time coming. Because there were some real dark middle chapters <laughs> in this uh, this series. So this is awesome. Uh, I'm gonna take a break for now, but thank you very much for watching, guys. I do appreciate the support. I'm Dude Long Couch. I'll catch you guys in the next part. Take her easy. <laughs>